County police are back on the case of a brutal murder. In 1959, an 18-year-old woman was found dead on the side of the road. Most people forgot about the murder, including the police. But as Jerry Gretzinger reports in his latest Cold Case 13, an unusual turn of events has led investigators to what could be their final chance to solve the murder of Ruth Whitman. The year was 2012. It was an ordinary day at the Colony Public Safety Complex. Investigator Kevin Terry was working his regular shift when a man walked in with a strange message. This guy comes in and says that my aunt was killed. He wasn't reporting a crime. The man said it happened in the late 50s, said his mother's sister Ruth Whitman had been murdered and now, all these years later, his mom was dying and wanted police to know they could stop searching for Ruth's killer. Terry had no idea what the man was talking about. Really thought he had the wrong place because everything that he was telling me did not ring a bell. I did not know anything about the case. Terry couldn't find anything on a Ruth Whitman. A few older officers recalled hearing something about the case. Eventually, Terry discovered an old box with the name Whitman crossed down, but nothing inside was about Ruth Whitman. Finally, a retired narcotics detective told him to check a secure cabinet in their narco office. Opened it up and there it was inside this locked cabinet with a bunch of other stuff that no one had known was in there. Suddenly, the Whitman case opened up before him. December 9th, 1959, Ruth Whitman, 18 years old and pregnant, found dead on the side of Sand Creek Road. Hundreds of interviews had been conducted. Evidence was collected. Mistakes were made. It started Terry on a years-long mission to put this forgotten case back together, one that would include a boyfriend later arrested for murder in Canada and a neighbor who would go on to be a serial rapist and killer. But the chances of solving the Whitman case get slimmer every day, and that is why Terry has chosen to share everything with us for our report, possibly their final chance to catch a killer. Once this generation is no longer here, the odds of us solving this are Zero. Starting tonight, live at 5, Cold Case 13 uncovers the sad and sordid details of the murder of Ruth Whitman.